perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Felita and Skylar here today to talk about our favorite TV show. Yes. House of Cards. It's so good. <laughs> so, well, Skylar mentioned it to me a while ago, and I really watch no television. The only TV that's on in our house is ice hockey. My guy's into <laughs> ice hockey. <laughs> And I just, I don't have time, and frankly, I think most of it's a bunch of you know what. Yeah. But. Crap. <laughs> crap, exactly. But this show, House of Cards, which is a so Netflix good. original, kind of think of The Sopranos was to mm -hmm. HBO. This is a Netflix original. Mm -hmm. And Kevin Spacey, just it's amazing. He's a congressman. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, Sean Penn's wife. Uh, oh, I can't remember Wright. her name. Robin Wright. Robin Wright, yes. yes. She's amazing. Mm -hmm. She's his wife. Uh -huh. And they are this power couple in DC. Mm -hmm. She runs a nonprofit, mm -hmm. uh, clean water uh, initiatives. Mm -hmm. And they are just. They're such an interesting couple because when you say like powerhouse, like they literally are planning and like strategically planning uh, their life and professional careers like a game. So, you know, if they have to use people, that's what they do. And they're both these characters that you kind of love to hate, but then at the same time you respect them too, because they kind of have the bigger picture in mind, even though sometimes it takes doing something kind of dishonest in order to make it happen. Mm -hmm. So. If you don't have Netflix, then email us and we'll give you our login information <laughs> so you can watch it. But. <laughs> it's, I have to admit, it's really good. And mm -hmm. it's one of those things, Keith and I would come home and we'd be like, are we going to watch another episode? <laughs> and then we'd watch like three back to back. And then yeah. Like, oh, 50 Addic minutes mm -hmm. or almost an hour or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very, very addictive. And we're like, when's the next episode? But anyways. So that gives you the baseline of it. So I noticed after watching this, you know, over and over again for a few weeks, I a couple things that I picked up on that, that I just saw naturally in my personality start to come wow. out. I thought it was really interesting. <laughs> yeah. um, number one, Kevin Spacey in the show as the uh, congressman is very good at delegating. He's mm -hmm. like, you, you, do this, mm -hmm. go there, that kind of thing. And I kind of, I kind of got in that mode, which I think is actually kind of a good Great. thing because mm -hmm. as women, we oftentimes, oh, I'll just do it myself. Mm -hmm. It's going to take me longer to mm -hmm. tell somebody else how to do it. Mm -hmm. And it, can I just be honest? Yes. A little bit, a twinge of like, I kind of got on a little bit of a, I don't want to say power trip, but yeah. that, <laughs> that like, you know, okay, you, you, yeah, you know, this yeah. sort of mentality. Mm -hmm. I don't know. How did well, you react to it? I don't think it's a power trip okay. until you abuse it. Okay. Right. Thank you very much. You're just wise with your resources. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, you bring up a really great point because Kevin Spacey, he has this really great understanding of the people within his network and even outside of that and like who his partner knows like who's in their network and then all he does is he meets with them once and then expects them to do it and then it gets done because you know you don't want to disappoint Kevin Spacey because his reputation like he'll come he'll come back for you but I know working personally with you Fluna I one of the things I really love is that you'll say you'll send me an email if you want something done and you'll say thanks for doing this this is when I need it and then that's it and you trust me to do it and then I get it done and I'll email you back and I'll say done and then it's finished. It's And I'm surprised by how simple it is instead of having a whole long drawn out meeting on this is what I want to get done. And I, I love that about the show that he's just so mm -hmm. fast at delegating and using his resources to get things finished and handled. Yeah, no, I think it's just a brilliant, <laughs> brilliant show. We're like mm -hmm. on the edge of our seat. Yeah. For the next season. <laughs> but there are lessons to be learned. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> How to better use your resources. Oh, yes, absolutely. Um, so we're not telling any of you to go out and, you know, <laughs> plant yeah. political corruption yes. or anything. Yeah. But I definitely think that that's one of the biggest lessons is just being really smart about who you have around you mm -hmm. and then ha utilizing those people instead of doing it yourself all the time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Great lessons. Check it out. <laughs>